Hi, this is Matt Saturnus for Plugged In Golf, and in today's video, I'm going to give you some tips to help you find out exactly how far you hit all of your clubs. Let's get plugged in. We recently had a reader ask a really good question. He said, how do I know how far I actually hit my clubs? And the reason this is a good question is that most people have no idea. Uh, we know from uh, some research I've done and just colloquially that people exaggerate the distances they hit their clubs and it really hurts them in terms of scoring and course management. So I'm going to offer you three different ways that you can figure out how far you hit your clubs, ranging from the least accurate to the most accurate. The least accurate way is going to be going to a range. Most ranges have flags at various distances, and you can just hit shots to those flags and figure out what clubs go those distances. You can make this a little bit more accurate if you bring your own laser and mark, measure off how far those flags actually are from where you're standing. Uh, but ultimately, you're going to be limited by the fact that you're hitting range balls, which won't fly the same as the balls you play on the course. And uh, when you hit a shot long of the flag or short of the flag, you're really not going to know how long or how short you were. This another option is going to be going onto the course. Uh, if you can go onto a course when there's not a lot of people around, when the course is relatively empty, and go out to say the 150 marker or the 175 marker, drop 10 golf balls and hit them all at the flag, then you can walk up and see how long or how short you were, or were they all on target. And that's going to be a lot more accurate in terms of figuring out an exact distance for your clubs. Now the most accurate thing you can do is get on a launch monitor, uh, whether that's a radar-based technology like FlightScope or TrackMan, or a camera-based technology like Foresight. Uh, those are all very accurate ways of measuring how far your ball actually goes. Um, now obviously I'm not suggesting that anybody go out and buy a FlightScope or a TrackMan, it's a pretty big investment, but you can definitely find a golf professional in your area or a golf facility in your area that should let you rent time on their equipment. Um, if you can't find a golf facility, find a retail store. Most, most retail stores have fitting bays with some kind of good launch monitor in them that you can probably rent out or use. Um, the one thing I'll add to this is that you need to be realistic about the results you get when you go on the launch monitor. Uh, a lot of people are a little hesitant to accept that their clubs only go a certain distance, but they're very, very accurate and that's the reality of the situation. Um, if you accept that your average is not the same as the one shot you hit the best, your course management and your scores are going to be a lot better for it. If you have any questions about this, please post them down below. I'll be happy to answer them. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also follow us on Twitter, like us on Facebook, and don't forget to check out PluggedInGolf.com. This has been Matt Saturnus for Plugged In Golf. Thanks for watching.